All right, Joyce, tell them what we're about to do. We're about to go down this humongous hill. There it is over there, guys. It's about to be lit. It's about to be lit. <laughs> Days. And now I got the show for the shoes and shows and chauffeurs with roll rage. It's about to be lit. <laughs> to the same damn ad lip. Ah! Always. Still got it's called Barter Town? Barter? Barter? Barter Town Diner. This is supposed to be nice. the best vegan food in the world. Alright, you ready? Ready? Yes, we'll take you in and let you guys know how it is. So we're at a vegan restaurant. He slipped up. I asked, where do your eggs come from? It's made out of tofu. I said tofu omelet. I know you said tofu, but I thought there was tofu in the omelet. In a vegan restaurant. <laughs> yes. We're in here and... Um, Justin's pushing these people's buttons. I'm the coolest cucumber yeah. eating my tofu okay. eggs. Stop. Bro, they can smell the heat. That's the water though. Oh, the water's really good. It's the best vegan water I've had. How there's a vegan restaurant right here and then the dog story theater is like right across the street. Four seen dogs perform. Watercolors, a trip. Aquarium gallery. gallery. It's like, like four seen fish to paint with. That watercolor aquarium gallery is like an aquarium, but it's like all painting. So you're like, you like walk in, you're like, I'm going to an aquarium, but then you get faked out because it's like, it's all painted they don't, fish. <laughs> they are all painted fish. <laughs> So then like when you grow up, you never knew that fish didn't really swim. So like when you actually go to a real aquarium, you're like, Oh, you're taking this to the extreme. <laughs> it would just be hilarious. You guys, cultures skin, collide. Cultures collide. Hurt, cultures collide by people don't get sunburned. Like when you get in a relationship with somebody, or a friendship rather, there's you have to get adjusted and you have to compromise for each other. Because your cultures collide. It's not a racial thing. It's a it's a it's a culture thing. Like race also plays a part in it, but just as far as you're like humanly cultured. Yeah, you come. Everyone comes from their own background. Yeah, and a lot of people are going through things because your cultures collide. But I think he sees that as a way to. I think you gotta admit to yourself that cultures will always collide. There's there's merging, but there's always the colliding part. Like a kaleidoscope. No, I just think that you have to be respectful of how people view things, and obviously everyone grieves differently and stuff like that. Look, hey, this was Julia when she was a kid. It's all mean. The thing that gets me is why do vegans have pets? You're holding hostage as much as we're holding hostage to make food out of it. You guys, no. you can I just you ask the vegans? Can, so I just hard. can I just tell the vegans out there? Can I just ask the vegans on that? No. Look, I'm 80% vegan. But no, I vegetarian. Am. Okay, I'm 80% vegetarian. And I just want to ask the vegans out there, if you're a vegan, why are you allowed to have pets? You're holding them hostage. You know, you're you want to let Gracie go out in the wild? You're dressing them up Listen, to look. Shut up. It's a real conversation. Listen, I think um, these are kind of bad. There's a lot of culture in Grand Rapids, but only at certain spots. Yeah, and there's also a lot of not culture. <laughs> Make sure you guys give it that thumbs up.